So in this Canva tutorial video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to pixelate an image here in Canva. So uh, first thing you have to do is find an image that you want to pixelate. Uh, this can either be through the elements tab. This can be through the uploads tab. It doesn't really matter uh, whatever photo is going to work. It doesn't really matter. So uh, just for the sake of this video, I'm going to use this photo of this cat wearing sunglasses and some purple flowers in its hair. So uh, once I have a photo that I wanna pixelate, next step you have to do is actually press on the photo. I uh, go to the top left corner here where it says edit image. I want you to press on that. Then you're gonna be greeted by a screen uh, where there's a bunch of different options. Now I have pixelate right here because I recently used it, but uh, if it's not there for you, just scroll down, just scroll down. Um, a couple of these things will load. Uh, just scroll down until you see the pixelate option right here. I want you to press C also. Uh, now you are greeted with a bunch of different options. You can go to pixel, micro, uh, grain, pellet, whatever you want. Uh, just for the sake of this video though, I'm just gonna go with the basic pixel function. So I'm gonna press on that right here. Uh, it'll take a couple seconds to pixelate. Uh, and now the picture is pixelated. Now, uh, if you wanna make it a little bit less blurry or a little bit more blurry, uh, super simple, just press on these three lines right here to where it says C controls, press on that. Uh, if you wanna change the horizontal uh, pixels by changing it to uh, the left, moving it to the left, it'll make it more blurry. Uh, moving it to the right will make it less blurry. So you could basically find the sweet spot if you want. Same thing for the vertical pixels, moving it to the right will make it less blurry and moving it to the left will make it more blurry. So uh, hopefully this video helped in showing you how to pixelate an image here on Canva. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next one.